Rated G. What's up guys, it's the Middle Age Gamer and we're playing part two of the South scenario, otherwise called Black Gold of 1890. I do have a game that I did save, so let me go ahead and get into that real quick. Oh, there we go, load. Um, and I want to say it was this one. Well, either one should be fine though. And we are also live streaming at twitch.tv slash middle age gamer. So if you guys are checking this out on YouTube, please come check me out on Twitch. I would definitely appreciate it. Definitely need to connect to Shreveport. I think I'm going to go ahead and do that because of the connection bonus. It's quite a bit of money. I also need to start making some additional routes uh, to get my quarterly revenue up for freight. Um, but we're doing pretty good. We're almost producing five loads of oil, which is what we're working on right now. So we're getting pretty close to that. Let me go ahead and make a train station here. You're expanding too fast for my liking. Would you please hold your horses? No dough, no show. I don't know what that means. I got an achievement though. We'll have to check it out later. And hopefully we'll get some guys. We had a, quite a few people watching earlier on Twitch. I was assuming we're going to have like two or three. We ended up having like five or six most of the time. I think our high was like nine or ten, which is pretty awesome. Okay, I got bugs in here. That's awesome. Um, anyways, put a supply tower in between. Go and set up the signals as well. Now, signals are backwards on this line than what I normally do. So I'm going to do it backwards on this side as well. A little confusing to me, just not used to doing that. What up, Off-Roader? How's it going, man? Go. And let's go ahead and set up a rail line from Houston to Shreveport. And it looks like we do have 200 innovation points. We're going to go ahead and increase the transportation fee per freight cart. That is the most important thing that we're doing. Unlocking this will probably be next. Both of these. So I definitely want to unlock the Mountain 482 you for really freight. You really should pay more attention to the maintenance what a pressure. of your Yep, back for part two of this. Trying to do what I can. Do hear a train outside, but won't be able to see anything on the train cam, I don't think. Let me just look real quick in case we're on pause, right? Oh, train cam's not even working anyway, so that defeats the purpose. What up, Rail Master? How's it going? What up, Racer? How's it going? Good to see some people on here tonight. So I just set up another train from here to Fayetteville. Just trying to figure out where I'm at. Selena needs a lot of stuff going to it to make it bigger. Kind of uh, less Selena. And I know I'm, I'm butchering that name, so I apologize. <laughs> Head crusher. I literally just ate pizza too. I just had a, uh, can't remember the name of the pizza place, but it was good. Ooh, drinking straight whiskey. That could end up being bad for me. There's vegetables over here. There's more stuff. Over. I got a lot of stuff I can do. I just don't know what I want to do first. And this guy is definitely cramping my style. I think first and foremost, let's produce the five loads of oil, which means I need to upgrade at least one oil rig again. That's going to be super expensive to do. So I'm not excited about that. 
Let's see what this one costs. 1.7 million. Let's see if any of the other rigs are cheaper or not. 1.7 million. And how about down by Houston? 1.7 million. So yeah, we're kind of screwed no matter what we do. I think getting more stuff to Houston would be nice. It needs fruit. There's obviously a fruit place right there. But let's upgrade the oil rig first. I want to make sure that we hit this, which is due in 1902. We're not even close to 1902, which is good. I want to check this off and then I can work on the 1904, which is bumping up my freight revenue to 2.5 million. And then we can really look at kind of ramping up the oil rigs to produce 20 loads of oil per week. So that would be kind of our shot clock, shot clock, shot clock. I'm taking shots no matter what. So I really don't need the shot clock per se. Anyways, we're close to 1.7. Let me look at just my loans. I think we can play the loan game again. So let's do this. There we go. Do it the American way. Let's go ahead and upgrade this rig. Since this one's carrying the least amount back and forth. Really wants me to buy this grain farm, which is not close to anything I have. I'm not going to do it. Guys, definitely cramping my style up here. That should get us to the five. There we go. Congratulations. Gold check mark. You are now I'm producing five loads yourself. of oil per week. Train Master does ring a bell, but there's a lot of people with similar names to that. And I remember I most people informed me that from back in the day, and most people have been up your with me since department. 2014, Those 2015, somewhere in that area. So, anyways, glad to see you back, Rail Master. I like Rail Master the name better, anyways. So, we'll go with that. Uh, let's hire the engineer. We do have. Ooh. What is this one? Maintenance? No, keep that. I will get the chief engineer on board. All right, so what I said now is we're going to basically upgrade our freight. We're on this achieve a quarterly revenue of $2.5 million. So that's kind of my next step is we're just going to keep building our empire and delivering more freight cars and making new routes even though we've done quite a bit so far, I do want to make sure that we achieve that. Say, are you a two point, we're quite slow. a ways away. We're only have already bid. a little bit under halfway there, so I got a lot of stuff to do. I just want to figure out where I want to start, because I have no idea. Maybe Odessa? Odessa needs meat going out. They have meat. They have meat. Maybe Odessa down to Appleine to make that dual track the whole way. Oh, bad press. Who Let's reads do that. the papers these days anyway? And I'm gonna make a little spur off somewhere over here. Oh, we do have a spur right there already. Okay, so we don't have to do that. Come down, deliver there. lot of little building yeah me too definitely waiting for train sim world 2 to release super excited about that which is kind of one of the reasons why I've been streaming I do need a supply tower here
I don't know what to do about this. I'm gonna have to upgrade both of those lines at some point. I guess now would be the time, right? Let's work on Texas. Since I'm from Texas, or I live in Texas, I should say. I'm not really from Texas. This would be a good thing to start upgrading, right? Surrender right there. Okay. Now we just need to set up signals because those are old. Golden Age of Railways, that's exactly what it is. You should look for your train. Trying to figure out. Okay, so I did that down to Dallas. Now I need to do this signaling over here. I think the only thing I really haven't connected to that I want to is San Antonio, just because that's where I'm living right now. So that's still gonna be in the process. I feel like I should have more supply towers, but I can fix that here in a little bit too. Actually, you know what? Um, I guess I'll leave that as a small town for now. I feel like I need a spur to connect those two cities in case I want to do that. Might as well since I'm doing this right. Yeah, no, it's a really, really good game. I've been advocating it for, or advocating for the game for a while. Definitely having a lot of fun with it. Still playing it. I've already beaten the main campaign, so the fact that I'm still playing it says a lot, I think. If you like these type of games, it's definitely worth getting hard. I'm not going to say it's an easy game by any means, but it's definitely fun. Okay. <laughs> I love you, T-Mac. <laughs> Thanks for following. I, I love you, T-Mac. <laughs> That's funny. Okay. I don't know what I have down here for a route, but let me look at this train. Dallas to Abilene. So it's kind of going between all three. It's in Austin right now. I'm just gonna do Austin to Abilene. That's what we're gonna do. There we go. I'm gonna do Abilene to Dallas. And then we're gonna do Dallas to Austin. There we go. Okay, next up on the list, let's see if we can get some vegetables going. Does Dallas need Dallas need vegetables? Okay, yeah. We got a few places that need vegetables, which is good. 
Let's make a regular train station here. Again, we're just so trying to basically increase our idea? quarterly profit by freight. So this is a really good way to do it, in my opinion. Is that, was that you, BBC? <laughs> I've seen that account before, so I'm like, wasn't too surprised by it. Not too surprised by it at all. And then I need to hook one up to the single route track over here. Oops. Just mess that up. And then this needs to come actually out. It's gonna have to be down here somewhere. Kind of an interesting route it's going to end up taking but it'll still work yeah this is definitely a good business game i mean it has stocks it has everything that you want to do oh that's that's scary why is that a one way Ooh. we're going to have to correct something that's the wrong way on the track I want to hire as many people as possible, especially given the pandemic. I need to make sure I'm taking care of people. Let's put a supply tower here for now. Delete this. It's going to have to come off of this upper track. I got to figure out how to get that off. So it's going to come around here, come into the warehouse. It's going to end up coming on the upper track. Okay, so let's see if we can do this. Let's do out the bottom. Let's make this spur. There we go. That's what I want to do. And then we can get rid of the bottom one. Signaling time. side be good so we can bring vegetables to Dallas 
and also to the warehouse too. Let's go ahead and add it to warehouse two. Kind of want to upgrade that warehouse. In fact, I'm going to go ahead and upgrade this warehouse now. So let's delete this. And then I'm going to delete a lot around it too. Make a warehouse with the signaling control for now. We can always upgrade this. Okay. Ooh, why is that 10%? Let's do something different. Supply tower back here. Still 10%, that's really strange. I guess because it's so close to the river. It's kind of a bummer. Let's fix the signaling. There we go. It should be leaving empty, so that should work okay. All right, let's get some things going. Nolan Farm. Oh, crap. Might want to fix this. So we have this going there. We have milk. And then we're going to have vegetables as well. Put them on max. And then we also want to make sure there is a maintenance building there. And a maintenance building at Nolan Farm. There we go. Perfect. So Nolan Farm to Warehouse 4. Freight only. And let's get one going the other way to Dallas. Oh, your station over a bit. There's enough space here for the two of us. Really? Where'd you hear that, Railmaster? Did you see it during the uh, one of the live streams or something? Woo! That is strong. That'd be awesome if you can create your own. Uh oh. Am I supposed to be on the top track? Seems off. I guess maybe that's good. I don't know. Oh. And another new oil field has been tapped. So I got a sugar there. Does this place need sugar? Yeah, it does. Desrix, thank you for the follow. Definitely appreciate it, man. Does Dallas need wood too? Dallas does need wood. So I got a couple things. I got vegetables going to Dallas, vegetables going to Warehouse 4, which is basically Wichita. I need to have meat coming out of Odessa to somewhere that needs it. I just don't know where it needs it. Abilene won't need it, right? Or do they need it? I'm gonna just do that and see what happens. You really should pay more attention to the maintenance of your locomotives. Hopefully it's a full train. We'll see. Yeah, it's delivering meat down there. It's good. And I wonder if I could do the same thing. We got more meat in Wichita than anywhere. So maybe we need to get trains coming out of Wichita or the warehouse. Let's upgrade the warehouse so that we can add meat on here. Cause there's 61 in there. If we can get that out to like Fayetteville and other places that need it, it's easy money.
I don't know why I don't have more meat going down to Kansas City either. That's really strange. Let's put meat on here. Wichita to Warehouse 3, freight only. There we go. And we can go from Odessa down to Austin has its own meat, so we don't need to do that. Dallas has its own meat too, so oh well. That's crazy, Railmaster. That's the first time I've heard of that, so I'll have to look into that. I'll definitely make a T Mag Express if that's the case though. So I think I want to upgrade the freight. Or should I reduce the price? Oh, it's such a hard decision. I'm going to reduce the price and then upgrade freight later here in a little bit. Um, we are producing 6.4 loads of 20 loads. Can we upgrade this? Oh, we can actually. Why is there no suitable freight? Are we overloading Houston? It's not good. Let's see what this one does. Okay, that one's full. Why does this one have nothing on it? Let me just delete that train. Let me look at the other oil rigs and make sure we're still doing the right thing. That one's pretty much emptied. Can we upgrade this one is the question. Let's go ahead and upgrade it, 1.7 million. Again, we're trying to do the quarterly profit for freight, but we're also trying to get the 20 loads of oil per week, which I think is gonna be pretty hard to do based off how much it costs to upgrade this. We're almost at 50 loads of petroleum, which is nice though. God, these guys are like blocking me out up here. It's a nightmare. This town needs milk. Does Lubbock need milk? Yeah. So we got we got a lot of things we can do. It's just what do we want to do? Let's do this. Let's make a warehouse with signal control in Odessa. Gonna be for milk. What about fruit? Can we do fruit? Anywhere down here? No. Wonder if I can get these off of that route into here. Anyways, I'm gonna do the milk first and foremost because we need milk basically up and down here. So let's make a regular train station. That's cool, Railmaster. Oh, damn, that's way up high. Hopefully, we can do this. It's expensive, but we can definitely do it. Yeah, that bridge is insane. I'm not going to double up on the bridge. I should turn my AC back on. There we go. This guy has definitely expanded the Lorenzo guy. He's cutting into my profits everywhere. One of your trains didn't make it. So we want this for milk. I think I'm going to go ahead and get the wood off of there. 
and the cows. So cows and wood. I'm gonna see if I can get it off that track, hopefully. We'll see what happens. Yeah, supply tower. Okay, milk's getting delivered there. Let's see if we can get this off of that track. That would actually do it right there. So that's Harris bringing to Odessa. Let's get rid of this guy. Harris breeding to warehouse is what we want. Freight only. Another train right there we have to delete. And then when Adam's chopping, we need to fix this guy right here. Let's go ahead and delete this guy. Lubbock to Amarillo, nothing? Keep it going for a minute, see if it changes up or not. And let's go ahead and edit this train to add that security guard. Okay. Oh man, I don't know what my favorite locomotive is. There's so many out there. I'm sure everybody has a different different thing. I know I prefer high speed routes over anything. You know, I can't say my favorite's an ice or any type of other locomotive. It's just there's so many things out there. Inventor, yes. Let's go ahead and do this. And we're going to upgrade sweet. our freight locomotives if we have try. enough to do it. So, suitability, route properties. There we go. Just upgraded all of our freight locomotives. There's still a train here saying it can't do anything. I'm going to wait until it turns around. I don't know what's going on with this guy. I'm gonna go ahead and delete it. Uh, no, definitely don't want that. Do you want to clone this train though? There we go. Get 
then I do want to connect this to the main route if at all possible. Can we do it there? That'd be nice. Yeah, we can actually. That's pretty good. And much cheaper than the other option I had in mind, so. Set this up to go to Lubbock. Freight only. Oh no! It looks like one of your trains has a problem. Trying to think what else we can do. Because these cities are somewhat smaller than the other ones. I feel like everywhere needs vegetables. Just don't have a whole lot going on with that. I feel like we need to upgrade this to dual track right here. It's kind of a, a choking point for these locomotives going back and forth. <laughs> BNSF was a dick to me in the interview so they can go derail an entire train load. That's awesome. Oh man, this is definitely a bad place here. Let's see, can we get a supply tower in anywhere? Nope. Hmm. Maybe what would help the supply tower right here. There Definitely getting our revenue up slowly but surely. We're 1894, a long way from 1904, but I'm still gonna hustle as much as possible, so to speak. Just want to get these guys out of the way. Of course, there's probably going to be more trains coming by the time they go. But this is definitely a, a choking point. Can I go ahead and get this done somehow? There we go. Remove that train. Here we go. Much better. That will get rid of that kind of choking point right there where everybody's getting stopped up at. Should be much better right there. Yeah, I know a lot of people like the the diesel locomotives the best. I see them all day. I think that's my issue with that. 2.5 million to upgrade that one. Let's go over this one. How much to upgrade? 1.7. Let's go ahead and do it. There we go. 
add another train to that. We'll add probably another train over here as well. Let's go check the Houston area rig, which is right down here. Let's see how they're doing. Pretty good. What do I want to mess with now is the real question. So Warehouse 5 to Lubbock. Let me go ahead and do this one. Unfortunately, one of your trains didn't make it. What up, Squiddy? I wouldn't say legendary, but I'm I'm definitely the T Mag, yeah. That would be me. Welcome to the stream. Drinking a little whiskey, hanging out with everybody. Excuse me, but could you keep out of this? You're driving the price up. Splits ask me to update in the middle of a stream. No, no, thank you. I definitely do not want to update. Anyways, if you guys are just tuning in, please, please click the follow button if you haven't already at twitch.tv slash middle age gamer. Definitely appreciate you guys for tuning in. And if you're watching this on YouTube, you can follow me at twitch.tv slash middle age gamer, as I just mentioned, to watch future live streams. Okay, let's see how we're doing on the task. Actually, get these guys out of the way first. Sure, why not increase the safety? I don't know why the petroleum stopped. That's kind of strange. 50 loads of petroleum. 46.74. It seems like it's been stuck there for a while. Let me just look. Maybe I need to upgrade the business? I don't know. So it would cost 850000 I'm almost there. Let me see what it's at. 46.74. I'm going to leave it and just see what happens. Actually, let's get Clark Farm connected over here. Doesn't make any sense for it to be right there. Surprise it's still going the old route. this guy and let's see what this one is Clark Farm to Fayetteville that can stay I'm gonna go to warehouse three but I need to add sugar there so let's get rid of this real quick there we go
and I'll clone this guy here in just a second. What up, Viz? How's it going, man? Doing pretty good so far. Trying to knock this mission out, getting the top rank if I can. I think I'm on my way there. Of course, anything could happen. I'm stuck at this petroleum level, which is kind of scaring me. 46.74. So I think I'm going to go ahead and upgrade this guy and see if that does a trick or not. Hopefully I didn't waste $850,000 on that. Or maybe it's because the petroleum needs to go somewhere. I don't know where all these bugs are coming Let from. Let me show you how it's done. Pretty nasty. One Jesus. of your trains isn't doing what it should be doing. I mean, look. Maybe I'm just overloaded on petroleum. I have 11 to 14, so I don't know if that's it or not. Got an express train, which I really don't need. Let's go ahead and increase the innovation point gain. I think that's a good idea. Connection bonus is there. I don't know any places that need ah, Dallas actually needs that. Surprisingly. The city's need of petroleum keeps growing, and it is good that you are satisfying the demand. See if I can just cut this in right here. And I'll just set up one to Dallas and back, freight only. Seems easy enough. Yeah, I've been watching some of the live streams from DTG. I'm super excited about the Bakerloo line. Um, really going to be happy to see that come out. And also play that as much as possible. So, Looking forward to it. It's definitely going to be exciting one way or another. Let's go ahead and crank this. I'm going to have one more train on this route. And then I'm going to try to upgrade it if I can. I need 2.5 million. We're only producing 6.4 loads of oil per week, which is really scary considering how much I've spent to upgrade that. Quarterly profits up to almost 2 million, so we're making some progress in that aspect too. Oof, we need more. We need more guys on this. Why are they going through call into state? Now I'm confused. Are these all call into state guys? Okay, never mind. Just kidding. There's only one track there. Anyways, let me get back up to here. Check the other oil well. How's this one? This one's doing really good too. <laughs> Get more and more freight cars going down. Oh, there's another drilling rig I completely missed. Yeah, I definitely want to buy that. I don't know how, I, I thought there was only three, so I guess there's four, which that's completely my mistake. 
why did no one else bid at the auction except you? So the question is, where is the nearest place I can deliver that? I think it's actually, is it Denver? Is there any place up here? Baton, Santa Fe. No. I can go to Albuquerque with it, but then I have to go over a bunch of tracks. Then I'm just going to bring it down on my main, main route. So I have to go through Wichita. Oof. So I have to go over one of his tracks, which kind of sucks. Go ahead and do the signaling. I think I actually looked at that was for sale, otherwise I would have never known. <laughs> Bripri actually hit me up the other day uh, asking for an extra capture card. I think I have an extra one to give them, but I gotta look. I've been packing up, about to uh, start building a house pretty soon, so. Hopefully I can find one to give them. I think I, I do have an extra one, it's just a matter of where it's at. Okay. So Elliot, all the way down to the warehouse, freight only. Let's go ahead and add the maintenance building since it's free. And we can up this or we can upgrade train. this guy twice. I feel like this warehouse is gonna be overloaded at some point pretty soon. I fully expect to see multiplayer on that roadmap somewhere because they promised us that on Train Sim 1 and I was super disappointed when that never happened. Ooh, I can actually make a refinery here. Maybe I should do that. Ooh, I can't put a refinery there. That sucks. It just went off the chart. I guess it's not big enough, maybe? I need to grow Wichita a little bit more is my assumption of what I need to do. I mean, it doesn't have hardly anything going to it. I feel like I'm doing good. I don't know. Still got a lot Haven't of things I could do that I'm not doing. You brought something useful back to me. I'm still curious. Oh, there we go. I did check off the 50 loads of petroleum, so that's nice. 50 of 50 on that. So really, we just have to upgrade um, our oil per week to 20. 20 loads of oil per week and we have to upgrade the revenue to 2.5 million per quarter and then we're still working on the transporting a thousand loads of oil to towns as well so I think we're doing pretty good just need to upgrade these guys when I get enough money I think me and Bree Bree quit streaming back in the day, even when we were getting like super popular because of the amount of alcohol we were doing. Uh, that's a good question. Can we do three bonds? I don't know. Nope. Is there a point where you can do three bonds? Cause I've never seen it personally. 
I'm sure there's a uh, maybe a time where you can, but all right, Real Master, take care. Definitely appreciate you coming by. Oof, we definitely need to upgrade this. Do I have anything coming from Thomas Clearing at all? Let me look. I don't, okay. Let me get rid of this track. And then what I'm gonna do is actually make it double track real fast. Yeah, I've never seen it go past two. I see the five slots for it, but I don't know if it's a, a time period thing or what it is offhand. supply tower up here there we go so there's no suitable freight this is king colliery to dallas probably because i'm overloading it with that does houston need any of that no nope. i doubt abilene no abilene doesn't need it hmm Dallas needs wood. I'm assuming that Houston will need wood as well. Let's just set up one each way. Thomas clearing to Dallas. Freight only. And one from Thomas clearing to Houston. Freight only. I don't know who else would need this right now is the problem. Maybe Wichita? Nope. Out with how much is this, is this guy buying shares from me? Hope not. About three percent. Okay, doing okay. All right, Squiddy man. One of your trains isn't doing what it should be doing. I do remember Awesome Gamer, so yeah, just remind me next time you get on because I don't remember Squiddy offhand, but definitely remember Awesome Gamer. So appreciate you coming by. 
good to see you guys. Um, let's see, what do I want? I think I'm going to hold off for one of these right here. Probably to reduce the weekly cost of freight personnel or this one to get this uh, increased transportation fee per freight car. Let's change this guy's route. Let's do that and let's go to there and back to Dallas. There we go. That way at least it's getting something every now and then. Something is always better than nothing. This guy need corn. I'm gonna get corn to this warehouse. Let's go ahead and do that. And let's make a small train station up here. So we'll just do a regular train station, why not? So that's a one-way track in. It's gonna have to take this track out. By the way, guys, I did watch the SAFC game earlier and it was tied 1-1, in case anybody was wondering. Decent game. Uh, we barely got the score at the very end, so I think we're still undefeated or maybe we lost one game. But we're doing pretty good this season so far. Okay, now I need the one-way coming out. running two of these trains. It's probably what's going to happen. Getting up there. Getting up there in that profit. That's what we want. We're only in 1895, so we have 14 years to hit that profit. 16 years to hit 20 loads of oil per week. So I think we're doing pretty good. I think what I want to do is just make a freight train from Wichita to Kansas completely separate if possible. Just make them go back and forth and take off some of this traffic or alleviate some of this traffic from the main route. Let's go ahead and clone this train right there. there we go. So it's, I think everything is going to be pretty expensive to upgrade except for maybe this one. No, everything is 2.5 million. 2.5 million, okay. Can we do multiple? Let me see what it will let me do. Can we do another warehouse with signaling control out here? Nope. We have to do it on this side, I guess. Yeesh. And if we did one in Wichita, where could we put it? Right here? Maybe on this side. So it has to be opposite sides, which is kind of a nightmare. Make a tunnel underneath.
see what it would cost to run underneath. Well, that wouldn't be too bad right there, but it's not letting me do it. Come on. How do we adjust height? There we go. That would actually work right there. Let's go ahead and do that. Super expensive to do. there let's do signals real quick and then we'll kind of figure out what's gonna go or be transported on here I wish my train cam had night vision on it uh, to be able to show you guys the trains going by. Okay, so this one obviously has a ton of corn that needs to go there, although we have corn coming down already. God, I don't know what we need. Beer would be one. Petroleum. Does this guy need petroleum? I doubt it. Get rid of this. Actually, look at one thing. God, I don't know. I mean, maybe sugar? Maybe we could get oil transported to here and then down. Sugar, max. See if we can alleviate some of the old trains too. Just trying to think outside the box what we can use this for. Can't do anything with that train. Get rid of that. I think it's a good idea to invest in you. This would need sugar. Well, maybe corn. Sugar, oil, corn. Okay, let's get some of these guys that have extra oil with probably up here. Yeah, set the line going this way. Let 
maybe from here, look. Value reach pretty freaking high, Jesus. Can we play the money game to up our loans is the question. Uh, I don't want that. Oh, I can actually do another loan, which is kind of crazy. Pull a loan out. I'm going to pay these guys off. There we go, five million so far. Let's go ahead and upgrade this guy. Upgrade this guy as well. And then we need, between the warehouses, some freight cars. May not carry anything yet, but it will. You really should pay more attention to the maintenance of your locomotives. Do we not get, I guess the corn doesn't get, see we have 58 corn over here, but it doesn't get transferred over here. So maybe we have to manually do it, which would kind of suck, but. X, I'm gonna have to let that go in. I've pulled some strings to see whether anybody wants to switch sides. I guess I need to transfer basically corn from warehouse three to seven is what needs to happen. And then we'll transport corn and sugar up if it's overfilled over here. Yeah. Yeah, that's getting some more money, baby. More money. It's got too many trains rolling. I need to like, I want to fix this track right here to the outside and make an inside loop to warehouse seven is really what I'm trying to do. Ooh, sabotage. That's not good. Send your damn saboteurs packing. You know, I could probably do it with this much space. So let me try that real quick. We can actually make an inside line to this guy, which is kind of a nightmare to do this since it's going to make a lot more traffic, which I really don't want. But Oh, crap. Did that wrong. No, 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 no. Let's get rid of all that. I meant to go from warehouse to warehouse. It's not what I wanted to do. It's not really a pretty circle like what I wanted, but I'll take it. All right, let's redo the signals. Ugly. I don't know what that is. It's almost like a half circle. Mm -hmm. 
This side's so overloaded right now. There we go. Got sugar going. I really need to get some of these oil locomotives going to this warehouse is really what needs to happen, but... So we need to increase the ones going to warehouse, what is it? Warehouse six, here we go. Same thing over here more than likely, yep. Let's find the one going to warehouse six. Clone that one. All right, what's going on up here? Okay, I'm just waiting. I'm gonna increase the size of this station because I think it just increases how quickly they load trains. I'm not gonna use the other two sidings as of right now, but if it helps how quickly they load, that would definitely be a good thing. Yeah, my, I wouldn't say my track laying ability is the best by any means, but uh, I've seen worse out there. Let's take a look at where we're at as I get a little bit of sip of whiskey. Super important. We're almost there to the 20 loads of oil per week. We still need to get that freight up by quite a bit, by about 450,000, somewhere in there per quarter, which means we just need to connect to more things that we can deliver. And a good place to do that would probably be up here. I don't wanna grow those cities anymore. Here we go. Here's sugar. That's a, that would be an easy one. Go to Dallas. Definitely go to Houston. Let's do that. See if we can just connect it right in here. Oh no! And it looks like one make... of your trains has a problem. Connection over here. Go. go let me just make a train there and then back and we'll take this one down to Houston freight only easy enough question is what else could we get into warehouse 7 for Kansas it needs more cotton obviously Vegetables are right there. I wonder if we could just do a separate. It's a one way, one way going there. Just want to make sure this is actually transporting it what it needs to. This should be filled with oil. Okay, there we go. That's what I needed. I need to get from Nolan Farm all the way down to Warehouse 7. I think I'm just going to run separate track. It's going to go through mountains too. Jesus Christ. 
Is it worth that? I don't know. Hmm. How busy is this warehouse? So Nolan Farm to Warehouse 4 is what we want. Let's go ahead and clone this guy. Getting close, 17. Let's see if we can upgrade any of the drilling rigs. We could definitely upgrade this one. 2.5. That should get us pretty close to the 20 loads of oil per week. We're also getting close to the 1,000 loads of oil being delivered to towns as well, which is nice. Oh, well, wow. okay, that actually added everything that I needed going back and forth, so that's nice. What else do we have over here that's overloaded? Just sugar. We have that there. I'll get your staff off your back if you like. Gonna add another grain train right here. There we go. And let's make sure this warehouse is accepting it. Definitely need to get this, increasing the transportation fee per uh, freight car by 8%. And I don't know if that may actually increase this amount that we're getting for the quarterly profit, but we're getting pretty close to the end of the scenario, which is definitely a good thing, making some good headway. And we're getting all gold, which is important. I'm just worried about that still, which is why I'm still building like a crazy man. You produce a considerable amount of oil each day. So we just got the 20 loads of oil per week and we need to achieve that quarterly profit of 2.5. Do any of these guys need milk? This guy needs milk. Lubbock needs milk. So basically all these guys need milk here. Probably Odessa too. Yep. Let's go ahead and set up a train station here and we are going to deliver milk. I wouldn't have expected such a useless station even from you. Yeah, we're definitely making some pretty big moves right now. 
can almost do what we want to do without worrying about any financial issues, which is a good thing, but it's also like we have to still work on what we're doing, which is kind of hard. If that makes any sense at all. So let's do this. Let's go right here to here, freight only. And then we are gonna go from right here to Lubbock, freight only. And I'll do the same thing oh, no. to Odessa. It looks like one of your trains Ooh, only has a problem. Three. That's not good. Same thing to Odessa. Abilene doesn't need milk, so I'm just going to run those three cars right there. I probably should run some out this way to Wichita, to one of these warehouses would be probably a good idea. We could add milk here. So let's go ahead and do that. And we'll put it in right there. Put another supply tower just to be on the safe side. that one more time there we go ah no not yet carpenter still uh working on trying to break the game doing pretty good though i think so far at least just trying to get that quarterly profit of 2.5 so close Your income is good it's gonna be my last task oh. and the we should get amount of easily the gold check mark on it. So. At your balance sheet. At least that, that's my hope. Okay, so I need to actually really ramp up warehouse six to warehouse seven there we go so i need to get this oil out of here go ahead and do this increasing Transportation fee per cart. I think that alone should give me that 2.5 quarterly profit because it's actually going to make the profit going from warehouse six to warehouse seven down here since the standard oil is right here. Let me go ahead and upgrade this right here. some eight white track you could definitely do it i think that's when i start breaking stuff though which is probably why i'm not doing that do you even okay. know whoa, whoa, what you were bidding on Two point two so far of the two point five. Definitely getting there. 
think I want to upgrade this just for the sake of upgrading it. You should look for your train. You could do an express line Dallas to Houston. Don't really need to though. Although it pays out 400, almost $500,000. It's pretty good. I feel like if I don't do anything, the quarterly profit is just going to skyrocket because I'm not spending any money too. So we'll see what happens. <laughs> Trying not to break stuff, man. I think just increasing this route right here should make the world of a difference. Get in there. Olympic Games being held. I don't know if I should keep, should I keep building instead of just sitting back? I feel like I need to connect to something else now. Where was I at? I got to bring in milk from here. Dude, these trains are all backed up. Jesus, what is, what is getting backed up? Look at all these trains right here. Jesus, is it a connection right here? Oof. I think it's because I just bought too many trains at once, more than likely. But yeah, it's trains incoming and outgoing on these two tracks. Probably should have made like a little bridge over to just skip this area. Keep it going though. 2.343. Uh, what else can we do? What else can we do that's easy? Fruit would be pretty easy if we can get it to the right location. It's just a long way away. There's fruit right there as well. Let's do this. Let's make something super easy. So we'll go straight to Houston. Get at least one supply tower. Do the signals. might need it but be super expensive to do that uh, Dallas could need fruit let's look at this one she has fruit somehow that's kind of crazy it's grain there Getting grain to these two cities would be pretty massive as well. Wow. 
Are you looking for a fight? This farm belongs to me. Let's see if I can get over these tracks. Go ahead and lay the tracks. Just adding a quick grain train route to this warehouse and then we can have this warehouse go to other locations as needed to increase our profit. Go to there. Actually, I need to this I need to add grain there all right now I can build the line sounds like we got 40 stations connected which is pretty crazy awesome sinker definitely love this game it's uh, grown on me tenfold. Just wish I could get this 2.5 million out of the way before we get to 1898. Still got plenty of time, but. It's either bad staff or poor materials. Or both. Trying to clone this train as much as possible. Probably have three running on it at first. Should be good. Yeah, that's plenty. So, so close. I mean, Jesus, the amount of milk in there is insane. Maybe we can connect these warehouses to another warehouse. Keep it off the line. Let's see if we can do this. Signaling. And let's make sure that these have maintenance buildings on them. That one does. That one should as well. So we're just going to run basically straight down and back. And we just want to line a train to doing it. Oh. Okay. There we go. Your we just completed the task. We can now see the final rating of the game. The oil wells Jesus. Are 
Took a long Texas time. Has a glorious Glad I made this two parts. Ahead of it. You will also profit from it. <laughs> They're both pretty annoying. Yeah. The, the music's kind of annoying in the game too. So that should be 30 out of 30. I don't know if that's the case or not. I feel like I don't know if I could do any better than that, nor would I want to play the scenario again. See what happens. There it goes. President. Yes. Yes. We just got an old tycoon uh, trophy on there. So pretty happy about that. So let's go ahead. Ooh, I thought you could only get a 30. I actually got a 33.3, which is pretty cool. Let's see if it gives me a president's medal in the game, though. I'm kind of curious about that. So if we go to scenarios. Oh, yeah, we actually did get a president's medal. Crazy. So you can get president's medals on scenarios, which I did not know that. So I think next on the list is going to be buying the DLC so I can do some of the campaign missions. But this will definitely go up on YouTube with the President's Medal. Help some of you guys out. Thank you, Sinker. Thank you, Vez, for hanging out. Racer, everybody else. Crusher, that's on here. Sinker. I think I said Sinker twice. Um, anyways, that's going to be it. If you guys are watching this on YouTube, please go to twitch.tv slash the middle age gamer and follow me if you want to see some live streaming. Um, for all you guys on Twitch, definitely appreciate it. Thanks for hanging out with me, making this game a lot more fun. Being able to talk to you guys is amazing. And Crusher, go get something to eat because you definitely need it. Except I, would, I wouldn't be anywhere at a gas station at 1am. That sounds like a bad idea. <laughs> Later, racer. Anyways, goodbye, everybody. Cheers and don't die.